What is going on guys? This is Waylon coming at you from Medellin and this is my co-working space, Ivy Laureles. or for a company? No, for uh, ClearCare. Oh, nice. I did work with ClearCare for uh, senior home care. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Is that what you do, that ClearCare website? That is the same ClearCare, yes. That's yeah. hilarious. That's awesome. That is crazy. <laughs> well, yeah, I developed that website. Mostly I work on the website itself. So. That's hilarious. <laughs> what are the chances? <laughs> so what brought you to Medellin? Uh, I took a vacation, went to Bogota, and then Never left. Traveled north to Barranquilla and came here. Nice. Uh, I've only been here for a little over a week, so. Okay, uh, cool. And I'm leaving at the end of the week. I do social media marketing. Uh -huh. I also do e-commerce and vegan activism. So I basically help the animals. Nice. Be free. <laughs> cool. I'm yeah. in e-commerce as well. I, I have a drop shipping store on Shopify. Uh, okay, cool. I'm doing the Amazon. Business. Oh, Amazon FBA. Yeah. Nice. How long have you been in Medellin? Uh, Two months, yeah. nice. And you love it? I do, yeah. Nice. Staying in another month and then probably going to Panama. Okay, cool. So I want to talk and tell you guys a little bit about why I work at Ivy Laurelis. One of the things is definitely the location. It's a short walk here, it's about a 15 minute walk from my Airbnb. On top of that, uh, there's plenty to eat around here. There is the Avenida Nutibarra, which is a street with a ton of restaurants, they're all super nice. Honestly though, I don't really go there. I usually walk to La Setenta, which is a pretty big street. It's full of, it does have a lot of like nightclubs and stuff like that, but there is definitely a lot of restaurants that are super cheap and um, I am on a budget, so that's usually where I eat. Secondly, I do love this soundproof booth that I'm in right now. I am a night owl. I like to work late. I like to edit videos late. I mean, right now it's literally 4.18 a.m. Which brings me to my next point. It's 24-7. I get a key card. I believe this key card costed me 30,000 pesos, but it's just a deposit, so you do get it back once you return the key card. Finally, let's talk price. So price-wise, I mean, this co-working space is about the same price as most of the other ones that I've seen and there are plenty of co-working spaces around here but yeah I paid exactly 
400,000 pesos. I believe that comes out to about $133 for the month. So for the month, I have a place to come to to have coffee every day. I have super fast, reliable internet. On top of all that, I do really like the modern feel that there is about this uh, co-working space slash office. A lot of the other co-working spaces in Medellin are very house-like. They feel like you're in a uh, real-world Medellin environment, which, you know, honestly, it is great. Like, I do really like that too. Um, but the 24-7 thing really is the reason why I chose Ivy Labelis. They do have a ton of different things that they do here. They do massages, obviously. They do things like acupuncture and physical therapy. Um, they have yoga classes. They have a bunch of stuff. If you want to check out their website, I'm going to put a link right here and also in the description. So you should definitely check it out if you are planning on co-working in Medellin.